So what is it that makes YouTubers popular? What gives people hundreds and millions of thousands of tens of billions of followers? So we have Peter McKinnon. What's up everybody, Peter McKinnon here. Who's just very charismatic and just has been growing since the beginning, kind of set the standard of photography YouTubers. You have Mr. Beast. Wins $500,000. Who gives away just a, a f ton of money. I mean, if I had a, that much money, I think I might do that too. But anyways, I don't. And then you have people that just don't really have anything but have hundreds of millions of thousands of billions of followers and anyways I guess it doesn't really matter I'm just here to teach you so today we're talking about Luminar's new noise AI extension so let's get into it Will Simpson here and welcome back to Exploring Photography. It's always good to see you. We are on the road to 10,000 subscribers. So if you are not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button, like the video and comment because, or share, do whatever you can to help me out because I love you for it. <laughs> Anyways, today um, I just got a briefing yesterday from Luminar that they are coming out with a noise AI software. Now, if you're unfamiliar with Luminar, it is an editing program that uses AI technology to make your edits so more precise, more amazing, and they just have some really, really freaking cool tools. And this is one that I've been kind of waiting for because Topaz Labs has been like the leading standard of sharpening and noise reduction software. So it's nice to see Luminar, which is very much in the AI, leading the AI development, in my opinion, come out with this noise AI. And I've used it, I have an engineer's version of Luminar Neo here, which will give us a kind of a beta test of it. And again, this isn't perfect. This isn't done. There's some bugs that still need to be worked out, but I'm pretty impressed with it so far. So let's get into it and edit some photos and really put it to the beta test, if you will. Uh, so here we are in Luminar. And again, this is a uh, uh, engineer's version. So this is not the actual full version of Luminar. So we can only do so much with it, but we're going to take this photo here, which if you look over here has a 200 ISO shot, right? Not much, shouldn't be much grain, but we are going to continue through this and go up and really put it through the test. So let's go into edit and we're going to come down here. This is the noiseless extension, but let's go ahead and zoom in here and we see there is a lot of color noise. Now you can see that there's a bunch of color noise in it. Color noise is when you see color particles and luminance noise is when you see black and white noise or particles. So in this case, we have a lot of color noise, but you can definitely see there's a lot of noise in this image. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click noiseless and it will automatically give you what it thinks the amount of noise handling you should do. So in this case, it says use the low adjustment for this image. So we're going to click low and it's going to go about its thing. It's going to get these cool little uh, astronomological <laughs> dots and lines and stuff and do its do its noise reduction thingamajig. It takes a little bit, but it actually works pretty good. So let's speed up the video really quick and get to the get to the done part. Okay, now we are all done. So we're going to zoom in here and just see what we can do. Let's zoom in a little bit more. Good, so here is the before noise, here's the after. Now, I don't think it did that great. So let's up it to middle. And here's the before, that's a little bit better. Here's the after. The other thing is there's a lot of color noise. So let's up this, up the color noise and see what it does. Not bad, not bad. Okay, let's uh, let's see noise reduction 100. Let's lower this and see what happens. We can make adjustments. Yeah, that's actually quite a lot. So let's raise this again. And here's the before and here's the after. And you zoom out and here's the before and here's the after. So it actually looks a lot cleaner, a lot better and smoother. Now again, this is the beta version of this and this is going to be even better. I have no doubt, honestly, like it's even better. Okay, good, let's go to the next one. And this next one is going to be 1250 ISO. Let's go to edit, let's zoom in here. Okay, we got some noise, let's go to noiseless and it recommends low, so let's click low and it's gonna do its thing again. So speed up the video to the next one. Okay, so here is the before and here is the after. 
definitely looks a lot cleaner, so that's nice. It's not perfect, but again, still in development. Let's go to the next one. And here we go. All right, so we have lots of noise here. Let's go to the noiseless one and see it recommends low again and go ahead and click that button. Now, while we wait for this one, they are doing a pre-order of this these extensions and I believe it's only $149.99 right now. Let me look it up here. So they're doing a pre-release of the extensions. Now it's not just noiseless AI. You get HDR merge, you get noiseless AI, and they're coming out with five other extensions over the next couple of months that you will get for this. Now, I believe it's going to be when it, everything comes out, $2.99 for all seven of these. So if you pre-order them right now, you get them as they come out and you only get them for $149. And I believe this is only good till September 3rd when they will go up to $199. So if you're interested in Luminar, just go ahead and click the links in the description. Uh, I am an affiliate, so it does help me out. It doesn't cost you any extra, but I do appreciate it. And let's go ahead and get back to this photo because it is done. And here is the before and here is the after. Okay. Good, now this looks pretty good. This is working good. So if it works this good now in the beta version, it's gonna work even better when they get all the bugs figured out and all of everything streamlined, it's gonna look even better. But you know what, just for shits and giggles, let's, uh, let's test this photo. This photo I took in Africa, it's got 5,000 ISO on the Canon R5, which is actually not that bad. Let's go into edit. Now, just so you can see how I took this image, here is, let me just discard all of this, all the edits. So here is the raw file right here. You see how dark it is? It was just very dark. <laughs> That's why I was curious how this noiseless thing worked. So let's go into develop and we're going to raise the exposure up. Good, there we go. And then let's zoom in here and you can see how noisy this image is. It is <laughs> so noisy, so bad. Okay, now one of the bugs that they did mention, and just so you know what's happening, this this green tent here, that's one of the bugs that they're working out, but you know, you don't really, it doesn't really matter for this one here. Next, let's apply the noiseless raw. Click here, you notice how it recommends middle. We're gonna press middle and it's gonna zoom in automatically because that's just what this does another one of the bugs that are being worked out and there's that green tint but what we're looking at is the we're looking at the noise because again all this is going to be worked out this is still an engineer version so don't take this any 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 way this is going to be all handled so what we do is we click here and check out the before a lot of noise and after almost no noise and still keeps all this detail, which this is incredible. This actually blows my mind right here because of how good this works. Uh, you can also adjust the sharpness, the recover original detail, adjust the color noise and the luminance noise as you need. And that's it for kind of a first look for this noiseless AI that Luminar is coming out with. Overall, I'm pretty impressed with it. Obviously, they're gonna work out all the bugs and it's gonna be even better, but for a beta version, it works quite good. And I think it's probably gonna take over the noise AI software because Luminar has specialized in AI. They've done it for a very long time, so it seems only right that they would have all of these. And I'm also super excited about the other extensions. I have no idea what they are. They haven't told us, they haven't announced anything yet. So don't feel like I know something that you don't, but as soon as I know and can tell you, I will. Um, but that's it. So if you wanna get this, if you wanna pre-order this, I highly recommend it. It's only 150 bucks right now until September 3rd. It goes up after that and then goes up again. So if you are at any point thinking you're gonna get it, get it now so you get the best deal. I'll put the link in the description. If you have any questions, um, comment below on what you think about this. Um, yeah, like the video, subscribe, and that's it. <laughs> I'll see you guys next week.